so the Bobcats are going to get the ball first and here we go from San Marcos Texas into the end zone but it's going to be returned outside the 25 to about the 27 yard line and that's where the Bobcats will have the ball for the first time they looked like they were much improved in week one a low snap but handled by Vitt and he's got Sturgis wide open for a big game down the left sideline inside the 20 still going inside the 10 he'll go all the way for a touchdown senior year of high school torn ACL redshirt freshman year of college shoulder injury last year big hole straight up the middle and a huge game <laughs> for the road runners we might have some offense today that's sincere McCormick who was the freshman of the year in conference USA last year his fence a new quarterback with your best running back and deliver something like that uh, how about the play fake there's Harris his athletic ability inside the five and he walks in touchdown the air raid system anymore too much run game. That one was way overthrown and picked off. Intercepted by the Roadrunners. Tackles last week. He plays a lot bigger than that. A draw play on third and long. And again, a good defensive play by the Bobcats defense. That's starting experience. Their quarterback competition in the preseason was spirited. And this is the guy who won that competition, Frank Harris. And went back to his hometown school, but Frank Harris beat him out. Handoff on third down, and that's going to get the job done. McCormick, I think, just enough for first down roadrunner today from Conference USA. It's already been a great day for the Sun Belt Conference on first down. Broken tackles, nice run, Brendan Brady. But this three high safety look. DJ Mast to play in that sort of uh, hybrid position. Number 13 for Texas State. That throw knocked away, incomplete, and maybe almost intercepted. And no shock that it's Jaron Moore. Has been at some big time programs and coached a lot of really good players. The field goal try, 27 yards out from Hunter Duplessis, is up and good. On third and five, we'll see how aggressive they are from this part of the field. Vitt is going to try to run, and he gets wrestled down. Big number one, Jalen Haynes, number one for 2020, and he made a nice play. Uh, I love seeing the defensive lineman with the single digit. They are also crashing the box with a couple of other defenders. And off right side and struggling to get there. To get that extra man, that rover guy out of the box, Rod. Well, maybe this will be a challenge deep. A little trick play with the pitch back run and some room to maneuver inside the 40, inside the 30. And I think Frank Harris, the quarterback, helped set that up with a block. Teammates in Little League and Babe Ruth, Ricky Henderson. Yeah, he was okay. Frank Harris yeah. moving like Ricky inside the five into the end zone for the touchdown. Sincere McCormick, but Brady's been a surprise. Harris rolls right and is going to throw back left. That pass was complete. Special numbers, the 2-1-0, 107 votes for Frank Harris to get one of those numbers. Basically unanimous, everybody on the team. And that was a great drop over the shoulder. The delivery to DeCorian <laughs> Clark for the first down. They're putting the ball in harm's way at the good start. McCormick alongside and he gives the ball to Sincere McCormick. Great run, breaking tackles, but there are penalty flags on the play. Personal foul, face mask, defense. This is clearly an easy call. Turns the head there. Confident in his offensive line coming into this game, but they're really doing the job. They played great. Harris on the move, throws on the move. Perfect pass right to the first down mark. They fell behind three plays into this game, and they have dominated since. McCormick straight ahead. Touchdown, UTSA. I'm really mad when Joe Montana left. <laughs> Hopefully you've gotten over it by now. Yeah. Straight. St <laughs> yeah, sure. Straight ahead running Brock Sturgis and a nice game. So Texas State, two positive plays on offense. It Second and 12 after the play fake. That pass caught and a nice run out into the open field. That's Shereed to the end zone for the Texas State touchdown. Kid who's had to fight back from so many injuries, and he's had three major injuries in the last four years. He pitches that one and a little move. That was a great run from McCormick to make something out of nothing and a big something inside the 30, inside the 20, all the way down inside the 15 yard line. Another huge gain on the ground. <laughs> Maybe time to move for Rocky on second and 10. Harris kept it around the corner. Frank Harris, touchdown.
touchdown, his third of the game. Well, Rod, you asked me what my thoughts were on this junior, Frank Harris, impressed. Huh. I don't know about that call. Yeah, he Tough call. Back. Over the top, incomplete. Penalty flag thrown on this pass attempt, trying to get the ball to Marcel Barbie. That was close. It's his head in front of him. Well, it's definitely worth another look at the penalty on the punt return. Adele had the spectacular catch last week that was all over the highlights. Players, if you can't defend yourself, and that's what the official is relying on. Over the top and incomplete. There was some contact there. No flag this time. Intended for TJ Graham. Well, there is flag. Pass interference. Defense number 26. Here the play. There was definitely contact. Can't convince that guy. Hand off. Big hole. Right side. Touchdown. Calvin Hill into the end zone. Well, the punt, me too. Last minute of the third quarter, and a handoff on third and three, nowhere to go. So the Bobcats' defense has toughened up. And have been good offensively. They have been. Uh, that big disparity in time of possession, total yardage, maybe at least a little part of it. Vitt gets away. Tyler Vitt, nice scramble for a first down. And Marcus, Texas. We've had an entertaining game, a rivalry game. Not a lot of history, but the I-35 rivalry. And Texas State going down the field for a big completion. Fourth quarter. They're just one of eight on third down. Sturgis, another draw. Making players miss. What a run by Brock Sturgis for a first down and more. That's the third sack for the Roadrunners in this game. Second and very long. They'll run that draw play that they like. This time Calvin Hill breaking tackles. Texas State will empty the backfield. Vitt all alone back there. Steps up. He's going to try to run for it. Vitt spins away. He gets the first down, not quite to the goal line, but it's going to be first and goal before this drive. They've had two on this drive, and now they have first and goal, trying to punch it in. Kind of a high snap, but the handoff was made cleanly, and Sturgis is in. Touchdown, Texas State. Third down. They're getting to the line very quickly, and Harris keeps it, and he should have the first down. Ten minutes to play. We had a crazy beginning to this game. And we figured this was going to be a close one over the top. And that is caught. What a catch. Contested. Brennan Dingle. I think Kevin Anderson gets it. It's not, that's not actually Anderson. I thought that Childress, the freshman, I thought he got his hands on it first. He did. He got his hands on it first. Field goal range, UTSA leading by three. Harris throws back. And it is... Incomplete. Doesn't really hurt you. Field goal try is up, and that one is good. He's a solid place kicker from 42 yards out. Out six, I think it's the right call. Game. Yeah, agreed. Vitt throws, and that one is intercepted. Coming back the other way. Rashad Wisdom down the sideline, trying to put the game away. Into the end zone for the touchdown. Okay. From uh, the coaching debut of Jeff Trailer at UTSA, head coaching debut ending with a win. Bobcats not going to go down quietly. That's the tight end down the left sideline for a big gain. Still 3-12 to go. Ball gets spotted until you're inside two minutes. So the clock is rolling. Vitt shuffled away from the pressure. Found his man who smartly gets out of bounds. <laughs> That one is complete. You probably, even with timeouts, probably have to think about the onside kick. That throw over the top toward the end zone. Jump ball, and it's caught. That is a touchdown. And Texas State deep. We'll see if he can. Clean snap. He'll angle the punt. And it's going to be scooped up on a bounce. That's Haydell with all his dramatic moves across the 25. Haydell, here he comes to the 35, to the 40. Still going. Haydell. To the 30, to the 20. Has he done it? He did it! <laughs> 90 yards! And the ball 
Bearcats are an extra point away from going ahead. They've tied it up. Amazing opportunity to scoop it up on a bounce. Well, they kicked it away from him earlier. Oh, my goodness. Did he miss the extra point? He hooked it. He hooked the extra point. Your fans won't be happy about it. So Harris will take a knee, and that will do it for regulation. So Harris takes the snap, pressured immediately, and throws that one over the top toward the end zone. A flag thrown, but that pass was caught. He came up with it. For a touchdown. That's Joshua Cephas. Now we'll see who the penalty is against. What a catch. And Cephas somehow came up with the ball. Whoa. He beats Morris and he somehow gets it. And remember, I was just talking about how they stayed on that last touchdown pass. All right, here's Tyler Vitt. Play fake, swings it out right side, getting to the corner inside the 20, inside the 15. Vitt empties the backfield, design quarterback run straight ahead. Vitt is lowering his shoulder and he's got the first down. It'll be first and goal, Bobcats. Field goal doesn't do him any good. Play fake. That throw is caught. Barbie with flags thrown everywhere. Got number one. What's the penalty? It's against the defense. Now, Rod, you the game to Vitt's left. They're going to hand it off to him straight ahead. He's got the first down and more inside the 10 still going down to the eight. Pressure coming. That pitch was almost dropped. They're going to throw it toward the end zone. It is caught but short of the goal line at about the three. Regulation from an awkward kind of angle for the field goal in double overtime and he missed it. He hooked it. Oh, you, you, you can't help but feel badly for him. Third down. McCormick straight ahead. He's got the first down, I believe. And the whistle blew before the kick, which is up. The timeout was taken, though, before the kick. Kick is up, and it is good. A game that had a crazy start has a crazy ending. The field goal is good. Jeff Trailer, his debut as the head coach in San Antonio. UTSA wins his first game 51 to 48 in double overtime. What an afternoon. Wow.